I'm G Nelly and I'm a content creator for Guild Esports. So now I am a part of Guild, which is amazing. They're genuinely like one of the loveliest like people in esports I've ever come across. And they already treat me like family. And I'm so excited to grow with them as well. And we're gonna bring you some really cool and amazing stuff. <laughs> I started gaming from like a very, very young age. I was always really into like playing online games and stuff like that. I used to literally spend all the time indoors and my friends would come knocking on the door and I would just be <laughs> at my desk playing like Habbo Hotel and all like little games like that. And then as I got older and I could like afford to buy my own Xbox, I bought an Xbox and just started gaming. So I used to be a YouTube editor. I worked for uh, one YouTuber, then another, then another. So I worked for um, a few of the boys from the Sidemen. We have the assistant on the first time on camera. No! <laughs> I've created some amazing stuff while editing. Probably a lot of stuff you guys have actually watched and don't know that I'm behind the scenes of. Meet G. I really wanted to say something bad about her just to take the piss, but I couldn't think of anything. One thing she did promise, though, is that she's going to dance for us in the next vlog that she's in. So let's look forward to that. When I first moved into London and I was like, I want to give streaming a go, I actually streamed through my Mac, which... I don't recommend, but you know, use any resources you have like available to you. And so I streamed from a Mac, an Xbox, had no other screens. I'd have my chat up on my phone and it was very scuffed, but it worked. Hey guys, we're going live at 8 p.m. Why are you filming that already? Because you like... got you got pre-warn people, Will! So the first time I went live was from my very scuffed, but it worked, set up. And I probably had around 10 to 15 viewers. And yeah, as I started uh, earning money through Twitch, I would upgrade my like setup very slowly, but surely. Simon, he donated a pound and said another one, and then he donated another pound. We were literally <laughs> done like can't 45. Charlie, you suck at this game. He said you suck at this game. It took me um, quite a while actually to even hit affiliate uh, on Twitch. And on my first stream, I used to stream Overwatch all the time because I played on my Xbox. So I play with my friend Talia all that time ago, who I still now play with now. It would be a very basic stream. We'd literally just game and there wouldn't be too much like plan to it. And then later on, I used to um, do like a G features, which was when I started taking like my Twitch like content seriously. Right, hello, how's it going? Welcome back to the second channel. Welcome back to G Nelson. Hi. Hey guys, so I'm here today with a very special guest. I was streaming for about a year on like 10 to maybe on a good day 50 viewers. So I would like do all my editing and then I'd come on to stream after. And with Twitch, I started to see my like community slowly grow, which we now call Vanelli Nation. And I just loved it. I felt like I had this whole little audience would be waiting for like my show or whatever. So that's why I kept coming back, even after work. Twitch was always something I really just enjoyed doing. I didn't ever see it ever, but it could be my full-time job. <laughs> Oh no! When I decided that I could have a career in streaming or I could do something with streaming, I took the next jump and um, quit my job as an editor and started streaming full time. And it's luckily worked out amazingly, and now it's my full time job. I feel like as a streamer, I'm actually really open with my audience and I, we talk to each other a lot. I am really interactive with my chat because I appreciate them so much. I like to hear about their day and everything like that. When I'm off stream, I'm basically just sleeping or eating. Like I will stream as much as I can. Um, unfortunately, I do suffer from mental health and stuff like that. So I make sure I take time out of streaming to focus on myself and and then I come back and me and chat talk about it and they tell me about what they've been struggling with. And if you ever are self-conscious about stuff, never change anything about yourself for other people. And we're just really like there for each other and it's very lovely. <laughs> My um, audience on Twitch, we call them the Nelly Nation or they call themselves the Nelly Nation. It's a huge community now. I think we've got way over like a thousand, two thousand people in my Discord, which is like where they all interact with each other. They play games with each other. They go on calls with each other. And it's so lovely to like have them. I feel like they've all found friends through it. 
So you guys have been asking for a long time about merch and everything like that and now I have the incredible support of Guild and as you can see they've got some very cool items already but we are in talks and in works of maybe possible merch in the future you need to tell me whether you want to see that but I'm very excited about it we've talked about traveling the world and like I really want to take my streaming outside of my setup it's something I've wanted to do for a long time now and just make loads of memories with you guys that watch me whether that's in Korea or in America or anything like that wherever you guys are that's something I'm really looking forward to but obviously time will tell with it all and just creating some really cool and incredible content that goes outside the box a bit because I've always just kind of sat at my desk and spoken to you guys and I just want to give you guys more so thank you again for this opportunity I never thought I'd be sat here and let's go